Welcome to another Silver Shares uh, Thursday travel experience. So I would like to introduce you to my most favorite place in France where I have so much uh, fun and the place that I feel really contented such a way that I go almost every year since like seven years. So I after Monaco of course but this uh, is the south of France it has so many other places uh, there's one in particular this Le Gorge de Verdun that's the part I just showed first and everything and this is the Antibes um, area people feel like they are breathing in this place <laughs> in such a way that uh, life is so cool and tranquil you're able to just look at the ocean get a swim the temperatures are much better they have like eight months of sunshine compared to all other places like in france okay basically the whole of south of france they normally have amazing amazing weather and that's why you have so many also green areas where you just breathing fresh air the plants and nature you know you have the city life side and you have the nature side where you can get to appreciate a long walk calm down put the phones away and just appreciate a long walk along a river like this which is um like less touristic uh, i must say and everything but I find um, it's calming and interesting to also see because then you're able to vary different places. Um, and the reason why I love the south of France more, it's people are also good, uh, very friendly and the ambiance is really nice. You may be wondering and asking, so why am I not living there yet? <laughs> well they say when you get into a marriage or in a couple it takes two to tangle so if one loves one area and the other does not love the area so you have to take a little bit of convincing in a way to try and um, make them come along or tag along with you but no problem meanwhile i get to have some time to um, enjoy with my friends every year so i can't complain since i'm able to um, get away at least just for a month or so and have time for discovering the different places and there's so much to see there's a lot of um areas that you can keep discovering in um in the same region so different small towns and everything they always have their charm that is just so um appealing and every area you go you will find artistic things uh be it an exposition or something be it in the outside or even in the inside and the colors you can just feel how live they feel like you just and the sun it feels great and everything and 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 so it's just wonderful wonderful place this is a gallery that i enjoyed very much um and that i get to see again where you're able to just um, enter through and maybe decide to buy one or something of a sort don't you find it beautiful so i thought you could just uh, probably appreciate the exposition in a way but if it's virtual look at these two kissing and yet it's only a hand holding i find you know i admire artists very much like how they are able to put things in place and have an imagination i love the sculptures and how they put you know it's uh the the body like in a very special way uh, i don't know if you can see this one from a distance uh i find it beautiful expressing the beauty of a woman's body but the colors are just uh what appeals even and you get to have some 
ice cream along the way as you take a walk look at the exposition outside can you see the elephants the way they look good and the water it's sparkling blue that oh my goodness you just want to jump in and in all different areas that you go as you walk in the village when you come to the end of a part and everything you get a feel of just looking at the ocean which is beautiful and um the cities are always very clean and this is a castle of two lovers who decided to even get buried in the same place so that their spirits can visit one another and they put so much charm into their castle that they made spectacles and you know dinners and all sorts of things just to put life into their castle and everything you enter in the grounds and eat of this castle and you just feel the vibration of love if you look at the garden and how they maintained it and 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 how they just made it uh, look beautiful you find it just amazing and you feel the love basically <laughs> you feel like you and to get married here you can book for a wedding or something but you better be ready to get away with over a hundred thousand for me for such beautiful views so <laughs> so in case you may be looking for a venue for your wedding a beautiful place and all get ready to spend like a hundred thousand just for the venue yeah so you have this amazing place that you would really 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 love and so i get to appreciate different places with my best friend which is part of what adds a flavor to the trip definitely don't you think uh, this was a, an old ship like train designed in a very nice way that I found beautiful and I hope that you like how it has been and then you could actually hear the whales sound inside it and now comes the best part <laughs> How many of you appreciate food like I do? <laughs> I think what makes the best trip for me is always like food. Um, I wouldn't say I'm a food porn. I'm not a foodie per se, but yes, I do love tasting amazing different foods. Like yesterday, I tried to talk to somebody who about trips and everything, and they were like, they don't need to go traveling right, left, and center. And I know and I agree, it's not everybody's passion and, and all, but when you can taste different things from different places with fresh seafood, amazing desserts, like, my goodness, you just feel like you're salivating. Like right now I'm looking at this and I'm missing holidays already. So because I'm showing this from the past and the desserts are amazing. I don't think there's any country out of the 18 countries that I have visited. You eat as good as you eat in France. And okay, maybe a little bit Monaco too. But my goodness, there's so much... Um, on the plate on the menu varieties that are great so i really hope that you enjoy food like i do <laughs> and you know like uh, get to appreciate just tasting different things from different places and enjoying i don't know what you enjoy maybe you can let me know in the comments like um, what, what do you enjoy most in a trip like what do you appreciate most is it the beauty, the, the sea, or do you get to appreciate the food, or is it just the ambiance, you know? Because sometimes, depending on who you travel with, it's what makes um, an amazing trip, probably. But I love it. Even when I travel uh, with my family, we enjoy ourselves so much, and with my best friends also. So for me, they fill up the whole package. And so you get to enjoy a beautiful sunset. And this is now a uh, Khan area. This is south of France. And sunsets are just amazingly beautiful. And in the summertime, you just, they, it's warm and nice. And you get to, you know, just sail back in 
as the sun goes down completely and looks so beautiful like you can just kiss the sky at that point in time i hope you've enjoyed this trip and so don't forget to subscribe like and share live love love and learn